homeless project started in 2009 when we discovered homeless people in our local area. We looked around at the local authorities, maybe they would help or maybe the faith leaders, the other community. Nobody was willing to address this issue so we decided um, that we're going to set up a small project, we're going to look after these people, feed them, clothe them, uh, link them with services. We decided that we were going to take the message of uh, Guru Nanak Dev Ji, the Langar, to central London to begin with. So we started serving in central London. We started off once a week and then we went to twice a week and then we went to three times a week and then we went to Camden. On average, we are feeding around 300 people a night. Um, but sometimes it could be a lot more than 300. Yeah, it's um, enjoyable. We do it like once or twice every month and it's quite nice to get out and um, pack bags and serve people. As I see, you should give back to the community and this is just one simple way of giving back to the community. You really realise that you're actually having an impact because you're serving like at least a couple hundred people. To involve yourself with the homeless project we have training in place. It's important for your safety. It's basically about managing challenging behaviour. You know we have good days but they have bad days. It's just that we, we teach people that you know, there, there will be different situations that you will be dealing with and how to handle these situations. I'm very excited. I was um, really pleased to do my volunteer training recently to get involved with um, helping in the charitable actions, which is always a great thing to be involved with. And I'm highly, highly impressed by uh, the organization, the kindness of people. It's nice to see how everyone's able to uh, get some food and a bit of warm drinks tonight. It's very cold. The different activities that SWAT do are, um, we have the youth project, which we educate the youth about the dangers of drugs and alcohol. We have mixed martial arts, we have the Football Academy, we have the Homeless Initiative. So we also have the Amaya Core project, which involves us to go and visit old people in um, care homes. And we have a Turbentine Academy. I'm Lex Ekon. Um, me and my brother, we run the uh, Beast Fight team in uh, Khalsa Primary School. The guys here love it. It's a good place to exercise. It's a good, we've got a lot of guys here who compete. You know, a number of wrestling tournaments, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, and MMA fighters here. We've also got a lot of kids who have won a lot of medals, uh, wrestling, British, uh, British wrestling medals. We all come in to train hard and we just get on with it really. It's a unit, like, we've all grown up together now. Um, it, it's important to know how to defend yourself and defend your families. And this is where we learn it. Uh, we're surrounded by great trainers, great teammates. This is a family, this is a unit. And that's why we come. If you would like to volunteer for SWAT, there are various different ways you can get in contact with us. Um, you can come through our website, which is swatlondon.com. You can email us on info at swatlondon.com um, or through social media.